Today on Master Comics Theater, presented by Tap Tap Comics, we bring you a completely new comic. Kate Bishop, Hawkeye, the real Hawkeye, in Don't Quote Me, written by Daniel Kibblesmith, with art created using the Marvel Create Your Own app from Tap Tap Comics. I am your trusty narrator, Langston Belton, joining us in the role of Kate Bishop, our own Lorraine Sink, and joining us in the role of Modoc, the Daniel Kibblesmith. We see her atop a building, Kate Bishop, Hawkeye, the real Hawkeye. Eleanor Roosevelt said, do one thing every day that scares you. I mean, she didn't really. No one on the internet ever really said the thing they said. I looked it up on quote investigator.biz because I'm an investigator too. Unlicensed. Uh, working on it? Not really. These days, I'm too busy West Coast avenging to maintain my rep as the world's probably greatest technically unlicensed private eye. Daily patrol can get pretty boring. Help! Until it's super not. From below, a voice cries out in the night, a jewelry robbery. Pathetic low IQ individuals tremble before the mental might of MODOK. Mental organism designed only for killing, which means he should be called MODOK. But whatever. Well, it's a new day, Mrs. Roosevelt. Time to do something that scares the dot biz out of me. What is MODOK up to? Does Kate have what it takes to get ahead? Will she ever become a licensed detective? Pathetic proportionate humans. Bring me uncut rubies or face atomic skeletonization. Yikes. I don't really believe in leagues, but this guy might be a little out of mind. What was that really good advice Clint gave me that one time he gave me good advice? Before. Never waste money on an iced latte. Just get an iced coffee and add the milk yourself for free. That'll save you like a buck thirty. Oh, that's right. Clint Barton has never given me good advice about anything, ever. No. What's this? A millennial archer? Typewriters and vinyl records weren't ludite enough? No need to fear the future, girl. You won't be there. <laughs> Crap! Isn't knocking over jewelry stores a little bit beneath your supreme intellect? Simpleton! I require fresh rubies to focus my psionic beams. Well, that's a relief. I thought you just craved jewelry. What mess has Kate gotten herself into now? What construction will be required after that explosion? And how would Modoc look in a new pair of earrings? Wow. And for a second there, I thought I had something in common with Modoc. That's it, Katie. Don't let him know you're scared blankless. You know what? I just figured out why this guy freaks me out so bad. When I was eight, there was a sleepover at Jamie Siegel's house. Every girl knew a Jamie Siegel. I want to say her family invented printers. And it was her birthday, and so she wanted to watch this DVD about a killer doll, Chalky or Chunky or something. It wasn't even the first Chunky movie. It was like Chunky 4. But it was the one she had. And Jamie said that anyone who didn't watch it was a baby. Hey, Modi! Well, Kate Bishop's not a baby. Blathering gnat! Why aren't you smoldering bones yet? Modoc is like a less hot version of the killer doll from that movie. And I'm going to beat him the same way I beat Jamie Siegel and her stupid not even that scary movie. Cute little T-Rex arms you got there! Will Kate's insults help her foil Modoc? What's Kate's old friend Jamie Siegel up to these days? Is Modoc a fan of Chunky 4? Cute little T-Rex arms you got there! With my eyes closed. Too bad they can't cover your face! Modoc, helplessly reaching for his face, squints in pain as Kate's arrow radiantly explodes! Flash grenade arrow. It's in the Hawkeye starter kit. <coughs> Knockout gas chaser. Honestly, they should sell these in bulk. So, yeah, that happened. He's down. That flash grenade idea was brilliant. Yeah, he's supposed to be the genius, but I'm the one who had the light bulb moment. <laughs> and you can quote me on that. Lol, I'm just kidding. Please don't. <laughs> hey, so do you know if this jewelry store is giving out, like, rewards or anything? And... Thank you to our author and friend, Daniel Kibble Smith, for creating this comic and letting us bring it to life at marvel.taptapcomics.com. Mm -hmm.